And we're good, Tanner. We're on? Yeah, we're live. Oh my goodness. Welcome, boys and girls, back to the Pokemon stream. <laughs> <laughs> and now we're dead again. Oh no! We're alive again. Yes. Yay! This recording this is like the days of our lives. The so two awful. like sands in an hourglass. So no. are the days of our lives. <laughs> Take this from me. <laughs> Take it from my hands. Alright, so... You can have Eric Vices. Oh boy! Oh boy! And I'll have Cameron Coco. Okay. And uh, obviously you're on Eric... You're on Eric Vices' side. I wouldn't give you Eric Vice if he's sitting on left. You know what I mean. I'm on everybody's side, Tanner. Mainly Connor's, because he's... Uh, he's Connor, Connor and Sammy. Dude. Oh, Connor and Sammy. At least go, like, top four. I really hope. Because Sammy's running with something really unconventional. Oh, uh, no! And then Connor's is wearing, <laughs> running, like, the high tier deck. It's funny. And Con you know Connor doesn't play Lele, right? He doesn't? No. I didn't Connor see plays it. zero Lele's. I saw his deck, deck earlier today. I didn't see it. That's interesting, though. I know. It's still good. Like I know. I guess he finds room for it, so all you gotta do really is just run thicker support lines if you're not gonna run Lele's. Yeah. I run Lele's, so I run like the 1 of Skyline and Silvalli so I can search up my memory. Yeah, I got you. Alright, so I've already seen Eric's Buzzwell deck once. I haven't seen the Lycan Roxy play it, and uh, I don't know from the set symbol or set and everything. I don't See know if it's one. day form or night form. That will be midnight. The night, that okay. is a Guardian's Rising. That's the switch out one, that's, right? Yeah, it's the switch one. And then, running the Octillaries, and I believe Cameron runs like the one Oranguru. A lot of people are running the one Oranguru. I know. It, to me, it seems weird because it's hard to get your hand to three. Yeah. I mean, there is situations where you just start popping off and, you know, you'll just constantly play stuff. But actually getting your hand to three consistently every turn without wasting resources is very inconvenient. Yeah. The only reason I see people playing it is because they didn't have the space for the Octillery or the Zork. Maybe. Yeah, that too. People always also say that. They're like, well, that's like two or three more supporters for me to put in my day. Like yeah. Sigmore or Inns or you know, stuff like that. I understand that. It's all up to preference at that point. Yeah. Oranguru has been putting it work though because like Zorark's good. But people are running, like, uh, Joseph, he's been running Hoopa, and Hoopa, like, he's running Hoopa 3. And no, the like, Shining Ledger one, where it doesn't uh, prevent TXs and GX attacks? Yes. Jeez. And it, it, has, it did really well for him, but, like, I've seen him lose. He won against Sammy, but he lost two games. Uh, the Hoopa's stall, but he couldn't get there because he's running the past Simeons on top of it. Interesting. And did you hear about the new past Simeon? Uh, I've seen, I know of two. I know the one with fling that lets you attack the bench, and I, uh, it lets you do extra damage. Uh, no, no, it's no. like thirty damage for the amount of pass simians you got. Well, now they have another pass simian, and don't quote me on this. It's either does extra thirty to forty damage. It's thirty. It's the it, ability. It, it allows simians do extra. Th 30 yeah, it allows extra your pass simians to do extra thirty per pass simians to evolution Pokemon only though. Oh, it is. Yeah, you can't. Oh, do it to basics. okay, okay. That's different, but I mean the meta is going straight up evolution anyway, so it doesn't matter. Let's see somebody open out with a Lele. Ooh, you know it always happens. It happened to Cameron today, and he, that Cameron and uh, oh Alfredo, yeah. Is. See, it's happened to him twice today, and he's still four and zero. Oh. And he has was that two in hand or one in hand at least. He has one in hand for sure. Okay, so he does run the Psychic Oracorio. That's the one that does extra damage depending on what's in your discard, right? Correct. Buzzwall on bench. It seems like Buzzwall usually just uses to pick on the bench a little. That's exactly what it's for. It's there for smacking purposes. Um, does he do extra damage with the strong energy since it does a base 30 to the thing? Or since it says it does 30, does it only do 30? I think it only does 30 if I'm correct. Okay. Oh. Max Elixir, let's see if he hits. Yeah, he's got it. Let's see. Simba. I've seen a lot of people run Energy Lotto today, too. Look at top That's seven. That, uh, Add yeah. energy to your hand so you can hit DCEs, special energies, and all that. 
Eric's setting up on the buzz wall. Your boy's got to use the first turn Kiawe using the Lele to get Ho-Oh set up with four energies and a choice band. Boy. See, that's strong. That's super strong. People are like, oh, Kiawe's weak because he ends your turn. so good. Well, if you can do stuff like that. If you were on Turtonator in this deck, Kiawe makes it, like, Turtonator makes up for Kiawe taking away a turn from you. Because it's like, you have so much recovery in that deck just for having Turtonator for the Turtonator GX. Okay, that's fine. We're recording anyway. Okay. Just keep it uh, every now and then. There are a couple people who comment. I don't know if anybody's watching it right now. Yeah, we have five viewers right now. Okay, cool. Hello, five one of, viewers. One of them being you. Uh, I'm out of it on here. So. Oh, okay. So we have four. Sorry, four viewers. You're still special to us. You're still special to us. Oh, gosh. They've heard my voice all day. It's just been you, Caleb, David, Haley, and me trapped in this room all day. Man getting the two Ultra Balls. Look at this man with his secret Ultra Ball. No. I've deck checked a lot of decks today, okay? Yeah. These people are running like Four full art goos, but four full art ultra balls. Four hype, not really four hyper lelays, but like everything's blinged out. It's yeah. amazing. I'm like, geez. But I'm a. It's two different shops, too. It's, well, technically, they kind of, it's kind of like now playing in here. They'll swap between. Mm -hmm. So it's like they go to Anubis and Sword and Board. Which oh. Eric's actually one of like the big guys who runs their league, from what I understand. You, uh, he was talking to me and Nick outside. Mm. We're gonna have to hit that one one day. Yeah, we went. To, me and Nick went to Sword and Board once. Uh, it was one of their like slower days, so we didn't see anybody. But I do want to go for one of their tournaments. It'd be fun. Do they ever talk about which league days theirs? Uh, no, but you can probably ask Eric when he's done. Are both of these guys four zero? Like this is top cut table, so. Um, possibly either four zero or three one. Whoever wins out of this, we're probably gonna see him play for the rest of the games. Yeah, I was about to say whoever wins out of this. I mean, that's pretty much it. That's what you're gonna see. Hold on, this man was that three? No, this is a ho and two sycamores. I thought it was three sycamores in hand. All I know is Four he has three leleys on that bench. Yeah, it seems to be a reoccurring thing for him because this is what he played with last time. He only plays three leleys. That's what I play. I like two. Uh, I don't think three's cloggy. It's just me personally. I prefer just two because I don't like having to send. I don't like having to throw them away for Sycamore. Remoraid in hand. Gonna play Remoraid next turn. Maybe an Octillery. What you got? Uh, that's that Soda Widow. So, boy, I like that Soda Widow attack. What's it do? All right, so it gets to use the attack that your opponent like used That's last, right. and it only needs one fighting energy and one colorless. So you can literally copy like a two hundred damage attack for two energy, and I, I love it. It's like just attacking the one. Got max elixir landed on uh, one, so he's got the one energy. So next turn, if he decides to take out the Oracorio, he's gonna end up taking a big hit. I like seeing a lot of these decks. Oh yeah, if he, if he like goes after that. That's just going to be it. He's baiting boat. them right now. Granted, Soda Widow might not do enough to kill him. I don't know how much Ho-Oh hits Yeah, him. me neither. That's the thing. Now, Ho-Oh. You can use the tablet and pull up ho -Oh if you want. Yeah. That's cool. Now, Ho-Oh. I want to say his GX attack is a... Uh... Another Ho-Oh. This is different... Uh, he kind of changes up this deck depending on what he's playing against because I have rarely I haven't seen the Hoos in the last couple matches I've seen uh, Cameron in. I want to say the GX allows you to place a certain number of fire Pokemon onto your bench. Well, yeah, Eternal Flame. Put three in any combination of fire Pokemon GX or Pokemon EX from your discard pile onto your bench. Oh, that's sick. Yeah, so he's you can discard. Phoenix. You can discard like um. Charizards, Incineroars. Yeah. And like just play them for free. You don't even have to evolve. It's just like. Oh, oh wait, it skips evolutions? Yeah. It says EX or GX though. Okay, so you can skip the. I, I get you. But you can only. Like, EXs are always basic, right? Mm -hmm. But you can skip GX evolutions, which is pretty interesting. And then 
That makes me want to... First attack is a snipe. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. No, that's fine. So it's just a buzzwall, uh, or a fire buzzwall, essentially? Yeah, but it's expensive. It's a fire and a double color. It's, it does 50 to one of your opponent's bad. And then, 50 damage isn't bad. This is right above the curve to kill some things. Like basics, at least. And then, actually, if that Sudowoodo would get some kind of choice band or a fighting fury belt on it... Yeah. It could... Because that's just a basic Sudowoodo, correct? Yeah. Yeah. It could potentially KO the ho If it uses, like, its bigger attack. Phoenix Burn for 180. The yeah. only downfall is it can't use it next turn. Yeah, and uh, but Pseudo Widow is basically just a throwaway. Yeah, I mean, obviously. It's to see if I could swing on one of your big Pokemon and take it out with, you know, with the same cost of me just yeah. throwing away one prize compared to your two prize. Is he Cameron's deck list? There's he's running three Lele's, so I'm assuming he doesn't run many Kiawe's since he's doing it. Yeah, he runs three. He runs three Kiawe's? Because it's like, if you're running two Lele's... Uh, like I run four in one deck, but he always like a dead card once you get you set up anyway. Buzzwell with that secret sh uh, choice pen. That that's also what he has. He has like places a secret. Buzzwell gets so knocked out. Two more prize for Cameron. And we're in top cut, so it's gonna be best two out of three, right? Correct. Okay. So I think this match is actually an hour long. So get comfortable, boys. Well, it's after we're done with Top Cut, unless the other guys want to slide down and let us finish commentating yeah, well, their match. We can go take a break. Floatstone on Artillery. Try not to get Stole Guzman into it. I can hear Sammy in the background just saying whatever. Hold up. He picked up. Uh -huh. What did you do? Was Sammy mad or something? No, it's just Sammy being goofy Sammy. Oh, I was looking, uh, it looks like he knocked out the hoe with a uh, Sudowoodo. Oh, he must have Phoenix Burn. Oh, Choice Man, yeah. Boy! Scoop. He scooped. Yeah, okay. Ooh, going into game two, and that's Vice Scoop. Uh, Vice Scoop, yeah. Yeah. Next time we're getting everybody like screen names. Oh my god. What was your screen name again? Tunnel Snake 17, boys. Tunnel Snake 17. <laughs> I'm gonna call you T Snake. T Snake. Well, T, -T, T Snake and Trip Star. <laughs> T Snake and Trip Star. T Snake and Trip Star. I thought you said Stripper. It's Trip Star. <laughs> I like that. I like that Staff Cartana mat. Dude. I wanted, I ain't gonna lie, I wanted that Greninja mat so bad. I'm sorry, you didn't get to play my I know. But apparently that's next League Cup. Or, sorry, yeah, League Cup, League Cup. You ready to commentate for the next League Cup with me? He probably won't even let me. Cause you do Paul, Top Cup with me. Paul's being trash. <laughs> you heard that, Paul? He's I, gonna... He's gonna hear that in the recording, and then he's just gonna—he's just gonna cut out all of me talking. It's just gonna sound like you're talking to yourself. Oh, thank, uh, thanks, T Snake. It's my alter ego. You've been replaced. <laughs> Check the comments. Anything? Mm -hmm. People still watching? Is this five viewers? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Alright, setting up. Looks like Cameron didn't open with Layla. Is Mui. Oricorio, Ho, and Mu X. It threw me off earlier too, but you can tell. No though. It does. It looks really nice. I'm glad we decided to mess with it. 
Otherwise, we wouldn't be able to tell those Ultra Balls or anything. I know. Man. I just hear this loud click. He's like... <laughs> oh, the man is aggressively slamming his Yes, he is. Down. I was like, that poor in did not deserve that. Do you know if Cameron's from uh, the Sword and Board crew, too? The what? The Sword and Board crew, like the guys who are all from Sword and Board. I uh, don't know who that is. The other shop. Oh. I did not I did not know if he is. He interacts with them like he is, so I figured... Yeah, I didn't know if Eric already knew him or not. It's like having to play your boy in the top eight. We got two of our guys in. I know. So we, like, had a way smaller amount than... Of their yeah, we definitely did. They brought in, what, like... 10, 12 people? Yeah, and we had at most six. That we had Thomas. Thomas Turner. Turner uh, Sammy. Nick, Connor. Nick. Wade. Yeah. We can count them. Yeah. We can count them. Fine. And uh, David. Yeah, so. It's really nice seeing two of our predictions get it to the end. Set up one on he out. <laughs> I almost said he out. Uh, like, he set up one on Ho. -Oh. And then oh, he out. There he goes. That is just 50. definitely like, say, turn one. It yeah. doesn't restrict you. No, no, no. So it's like, oh, hey, I'm just going to set up real good. And then he runs Terminators in deck, I believe, if you look at his list. So, like, Nitro Tank just gets you back, you set up. Nitro tank just gets him back and set up if he ends up getting behind. That's true, because it doesn't let you like attach yeah. like a whole bunch. It's like they're like this is a really good fire deck. I'm scared to see if Connor ends up being matched up against Cameron because Connor's running steel. Ooh, that yeah. would hurt him so bad. And like Kiawe just gets it set up sooner. Connor's gonna have to pull through. That's if he gets there. We're still not counting Eric out though. Eric got the Soto Wodo in hand. Play it down. I know you want to. I want to see that Soto Wodo take stuff out again. Rimmer Raid. And Soto Wodo. I, I had the long pause because he didn't play it at first. He like snuck it onto the bench. No, he was holding on to it. <laughs> Fighting energy. Floatstone. Retreating out for Buzzwool. Choice Man Buzzwool. Retreat out for the other ho. -Oh. Like a phoenix, he is going to come in, but uh, <clears throat> that's not. I'm pretty. Normal. I'm pretty sure Eric's probably got like uh, a max elixir or something to set up on that little widow. Probably try to get the revenge kill. His ho, -Oh ho has what base two ten. Uh, if I'm correct, it's one ninety. Okay. What? There's high five. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was just looking up a card and all of a sudden, <laughs> clank! Ah. I was like, oh my god. Why don't we have that kind of, kind of relationship. relationship? Come on. Yeah. Yay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Terminator is actually not bad. No, I love Terminator. I run one in my Silver Valley. The Shell Trap is really good. Shell trip against the steel deck with a choice fan does like a hundred damage. God. And then they just have to either take the eighty or like just wait the turn. It's so scary, dude. That's so like you said, it's so scary. I wouldn't want to be against that. <laughs> it's like a hundred for free and you just like wait for them to hit you. God. And then he just has a double fire and a colorless energy. So do do? Let's see. All right, shut, put the red rock down for extra damage. Sycamore, come on, show me the max elixir. But he can't even use it yet. Now that I think about it. Now the Sodo needs two to get off, and I don't know if he has anything to put energy down on him. So did he might attach? Die. Did he attach last turn? He just attached to Sodoro. Oh, did he? Yeah. And he was inactive, so like he can't max the yeah. laser. And uh, he just switched out Oracorio, so... 
I don't know what he's doing. For. Okay, oh, close. Okay. He's gonna leave him safe. Probably throw something else out to. Yeah, he's probably about to chunk to Ori. Yeah, yep. that's how I do. Hey man, you don't want your. I mean, it's a fire. Free Play that Guzma. Oh, oh, taking another buzzle. We had actual hype in this in the street. We did. No, it's gonna die. It's going to die. <laughs> <laughs> the threats are being made, boys and girls. My phone's so cold because it's dead. <laughs> Stone Cold dead. Also, we're not streaming anymore. Are we not? It's okay, the recording will get posted afterwards. So it's starting to get kilowatts. So does his computer record the actual yeah. footage and the audio or just audio? It's not recording their audio, it's recording the footage of the game and our audio. That's all I'm talking about. Yeah. Yeah. And it streams live again. Okay, cool. Check and see if people are still good old in. shanty internet. And the word was shanty. Where, where do they get that cool little GX counter? I think they get custom counters. I know people are using their little book Pikachu coins now. Yeah. Connor asked me if I could. I was like, yeah, it's fine. I was like, oh, okay. I was like, as long as it represents what's what. Um, it says we're live with three viewers, but at the same time, my screen is black. So. I put GX counters on both sides of the table just so they'd have them on hand so we can actually tell what's going on. I know. Well, I'll Why does Poison my... and Burn so, suck so much in this uh, meta? Burn's good, poison just... Well, I'm not, I am not. haven't seen any of it today. Or recently. And you would think since like poison came out with so much like support for itself that you would, but Yeah. It doesn't. It all it does is add more damage counters. It still doesn't kill. It's like why would you value uh poisoning like a a, a dot on putting a dot on something yeah. rather than killing it. And I think that's the problem because people don't want to leave things alive that long. Boy Soda Widow's coming in. Or he did already pick the knockout. Pick up the knockout. Was that Mew? This blue prize is on his side and two on his What's side. What's that right there? Is that, that that's Volcanian? Maybe? No. I can't tell what that is. That looks like it's Dawn cool. Wings Necrozma. He doesn't have one, huh? He should. He does. He does. Yeah, he runs one. Wow. I saw that earlier. For what? What's his GX attack require? Let me, let me check it. Oh, it's something ridiculous, I think. I think it might be DCE's or uh, call, I'll call this for it too. Maybe not. Does he uh does he run rainbow energy in his list? Because I haven't seen any. Uh nope, fourteen fire. Alright, so he's running it for something. I wanna know what. There you go. He's setting up a Mew right now. Oh no, he's using it for the Mew. Is it Oh, is that what it is? But he has to have the energy requirements. So he has to have the psychic energy. What does the ability do? Once in your turn, uh, before you attack, if this Pokemon is on your bench, you may switch it with your active. You know what it probably is? What? Just to get stuff off the active spot. Yeah. Oh, sorry. We can, like, they can hear y'all very well. All right, we're going to have to speak up a little bit. Who, the, the stream? Yeah. Let's scoot in. Hello, this is a... Your local Deadpool, and uh, today I'm here to harass your ears. Uh, it looks like uh, after all of that good wasted time of us talking, the the game's already over. The game's over. Uh, the first and second place people are already done. And we'll move on to the next shortly. Probably not shortly. I think we have at least another thirty minutes. Probably. Is anybody even looking at the stream? 
Uh, I think it's at like five viewers. Sorry, I was, I was texting my baby mama. Fair enough. Uh, went offline. <laughs> Congratulations. We're online right now. Maybe it's a reload. Yeah, let me try it again. Oh yeah, it says we have seven viewers now. Ooh, boy, we moving up, moving on up. <laughs>